Next up we have Newcomers Whizbang Vortex versus another newcomer in St. Hammer versus yet another newcomer in Dogmeat versus the very big veteran of Hypnodisc. Let's get to the arena! From Banbury, Hypnodisc. A powerful flywheel on the front provides his main rebrie which can rip the shreds out of other completing robots. It's also got a tough armament and it's very nippy at 10, 15 centimetres per second. However, it has no Shremek and it is unreliable. From Essex, Saint Hammer. Saint Hammer has a powerful full body swinging hammer as its main weaponry and it's based upon the style of Stinger. It's very heavy this weaponry but the wheels are exposed. From Huntingdon, Whizbang Vortex. A motor powered spinning bar with two massive teeth in it and provides the main weaponry for this machine. Nippy at 12cm per second but a very high ground clearance at the back and exposed wheels could mean danger. From Gloucester, dog meat. Named so because that's what they believe they can turn all their opponents into. It's got a powerful motorized spinning flywheel on the front, very top, very high top speeds. However, a high ground clearance and no stream it could make them be the dog meat instead. Rubitiers, stand by. Three, two, one. Activated. Then Saint Hammer immediately going for the rock, picking up a whiz bang vortex. Didn't really work out. <laughs> Didn't really work out for the way they'd hoped, and now they have been absolutely obliterated. Goodbye to them. Whiz bang vortex trying to get on the offensive. Couldn't. The house robots may as well just scoop up the pieces because that's all that's left. Mm. Make a bit of a fail moment there, if you will. If you like the sounds of that, I do. I love the sounds of that. A fail moment from the pit. And now it's with bang vortex is turned. Once again, ah! This time on Hypno Disc. Well, there was a brick. Uh, and I wonder if it is going to move after that. I'm not too sure what it can yet. Ah! Oh, that top bit's blades come on! Could still be a comeback for Hypnotis. Whiz Bang Vortex. He's doing alright, I must admit. Whiz Bang Vortex is better than I thought he would. And look at that, he can't seem to reach Hypnotis now. So Hypnotis could still very quite easily come back into this one. Dolby's got the push, yeah, sure, whatever. That doesn't really do much for you in this game. Well, doesn't do, I suppose. There's the floor flipper for part of St. Hammer. And the rest of it is soon to follow. <laughs> On the floor flipper it all goes. Three, two, one! Then a wheel and the part of the hammer go out of the arena, the rest of it stays in. And meanwhile, what the hell is Shunt doing? What is Shunt doing? It's not Shunt. Sorry about that. The are twins, it is just with the computer. It is easy to confuse the two, but only one robot can win. At this rate, it looks like it could be with a monitor. and ball dog me. Too close then to the pit of the roof of the And there's dog meat now. There's with bang for it. Oh, but the man that my dog vortex is gone. So it's between these two now. Hitting that desk and dog meat. Which one? But the <laughs> I think we just found our answer to hit the disc. Trying to escape from there. But it gets shunted back towards the pit and maybe out with Bang Vortex. The weapon's still going, you can't exactly come back from that. Hit the disc now, trying to fight back. There's dog meat still coming in on the attack. This is a good battle between these two. Look at this, they're neck and neck at the moment. Ah, oh, but dog meat! I think might have finally done it. Oh, down goes Hit the disc. Cease and dog meat make it through to the next round. And dog meat just scrapes through after losing its weapon. They go through, but now we have last time's failures: Death Sled versus Newcomer's Golden Egg versus the Hassock's Hog versus Killer Two, the current RWA Christmas Special Champions. Let's get to the arena right now. From Sussex, Death Sled. 
Uh, it's great to see the Sussex team of Death's led back again. They came here last time around without doing too well. They got battering ram front and they got very heavy armament, but it didn't really save them. Can they do better than last time? From Totten, the golden egg. No weaponry, no power, no push, no speed, no good armament, and no chance of self-writing. Yet they think they could absolutely breeze through this competition. <laughs> oh dear. From Hassocks in West Sussex, Hassocks Hog 3. So Hassocks Hog with a powerful full-bodied full flipper, flipping tusks as ever, spiky, powerful, fast, nippy, that's what they say. I think this could go out rather early, to be 100% honest. From Leamington Spa and reigning Christmas champion, Killer 2. Without a doubt the most successful robot ever in Robot Wars Arm again. It has two double flippers. It's very, very powerful. The first robot to flip a house robot out of the arena in Robot Wars Arm again. And it's won more titles than anybody else in Robot Wars Arm again. Rubertius, stand by. Three, two, one. Activate. So there's Hassocks Hog 3 immediately start, starting there on Death Sled. A Death Sled! Immediately getting chucked up into the air. Didn't do too well last time. There's Golden Egg! Golden Egg! Oh! Was flipped over. Righted by Crow. Only been flipped over again. Stopped by Killer 2. There's Death Sled once again. Coming on the attacking Killer 2. Why? I don't know. What? Is there some sort of suicide wish? Look at that. Now Hassocks Hog. Three coming in, coming in on the attack of Death Sled, their flipper. Doesn't seem to be quite as powerful as Killer 2 does, does it? Look at that, meanwhile, Killer 2 is definitely doing more, more of the work here. The current Christmas special tournament champions. Look at that, they're chucking them all over the place and on their side. And again. Oh, yeah, now Killer 2 was flipped over, has to snob their flips them back. Golden Egg, uh, what are you doing, lads? You are uh, planning on coming back into this one soon? Uh, I'm not too sure, to be honest, I don't think they are, actually. I think they just came in, quickly decided they wanted, they wanted to surrender, and ran away again. I think that's exactly what happened. There's Hassock's Hog, meanwhile, getting Death Sled caught on it. Death Sled now stuck on its side. Being shunted towards the drop zone, went a bit too far there, didn't you? Hassocks Hog, Hassocks Hog, we wanted to flip up and over. Left bot continuing the countdown on Golden Egg until, well, that happened. There's malfunction. Oh, writing Hassocks Hog there. By accident, I'm sure. He's not that generous. And in the video, can we not seem to be able to get a hold of Golden Egg? <laughs> seem not be able to get a hold of Golden Egg. Look at the Growler here. <laughs> Now they're trying to get a hold of Golden Egg, it's like a dog trying to get a hold of a ball. Sort of fits the purpose actually, there's Death Sled meanwhile, Red Bob going to go check up on them, because they haven't self right to do it. Well, they haven't self right at all actually. Don't know about eons ago, they haven't self right at full stop. Now well, hits the boot release button. The Golden Egg. And Golden Egg is bound to topple any second now, yep, yeah, down goes Golden Egg. Good to see a growler. Meanwhile, these two are still fighting out. Hassan Sword 2 and Killer 2. The most successful robot ever versus Hassan Hog 3. Not the most successful robot ever. Never really made much of an impact until today, actually, when it had to get that really good flip earlier. But I'm not too sure whether they're going to get away with winning this here tonight. They missed a flip then, that was bad control. And they've been flipped up and over. Red Boss counting out Death Sled meanwhile. Over oh, away he goes the Hassan Hog once again. And out the arena. There it goes. Last time gone out the arena. Death Sled being counted out. Has been counted out I think now actually. Yes it has. Indeed kill lot coming up there. And also malfunction with the axe. Has managed to pierce it. Look at the strength behind that. That is a wooden robot there. One of the heaviest materials ever in Rebels Armageddon. It's one of the heaviest robots in Robot Wars Armageddon because of it. And Growler. And Killer Lock coming in on the attack on oh, Death Sled. What did they do to anybody? Ah! Until the Winnie do it. Don't attack them more. Well, actually, yes, do. Go on. Well, give them credit. It lasted a bit longer than it did last time. 
for about a second, I think. And it was that terrible, it was a terrible floor flip. I think that's the worst floor flip we've ever had. And apart from that, we ever we flipped Christmas movie. And there's Gilar plucking a bit of the snow off. Oh dearie, 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 mate. Shut out the arena goes death sled. Cease. So, okay. <laughs> Killer 2 are the winners of that battle.